Yo, what's up everyone? I will be showing you the best ways on how to get every single color joggers for the male and female character. Now, this does work after the latest patch 1.67. And as always, I will be letting you know which clothing glitch does work for the female and male character. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you're new, share it with your friends, and let's not waste any more time and let's get straight into the video. Now, for the first jogger glitch, this also works for the female and male character. I will be showing you on how to get tan joggers easily. Now, this also works for old gen and new gen. You will need to go over to this suburban store on the map. Now, once you're here, you will need to register as secure reserve. Go over to your interaction menu. Go over to the map blip options. Go over to the jobs. Go over to the stunt race and make sure you put it on show. Now, on the secure reserve management, go over to the style. Cycle through it till you find the warlord outfit. Close the interaction menu, walk inside of the blue marker, and press right on the d-pad to load up the mission. Now, you should be loading inside of a job mission like this. Now, basically, what you need to do is go over to confirm settings and launch the mission. Now, you should be loading inside of a second job menu like this. Now, you should be loading inside of a second job menu like this. Now, wait about 5 seconds or so once you're in the second job menu and basically quit out the job. So after you quit out the job, basically you should be loading inside of a random GTA 5 online lobby. And once you do load in, run as fast as you can inside of the clothing store. And press right on the D-pad at the top section. And just wait about there, about like 5 or 10 seconds. Then eventually you should be getting kicked from the top section. Now open up your interaction menu and unregister as secure reserve. And basically... What you could do is now, you could basically change everything on the joggers, the shoes, gloves, mask, helmet, shirt, whatever you like. And make sure you save this as an outfit, like this video, subscribe if you're new, and let's move on to the other jogger glitch of this video. Now, for this jogger glitch, this works for the old gen and new gen as well. For the female and male character, I will be showing you on how to get the red and black joggers. Now, if you want the black joggers, you have to be the host. If you want the red joggers, you have to be the second player that joins. Now, if you want the black joggers, basically just call up your mobile operation center, register as secure reserve, and tell the person that is helping you, invites you to their secure reserve. So, basically, both of y'all go inside of the mobile operation center and tell your friend, or if you're hosting, just go over to this touchscreen device, go over to the missions, and on the missions, you will need to start up the mission called a work dispute. Now, if it's locked, basically just do bunker missions. Now, on this job menu, make sure you put the difficulty on easy. And both of y'all, once y'all are both in, just launch the mission. Now, you should be loading inside of the job mission like this. Now, make sure both of y'all leave the plane. So, once y'all both leave the plane, basically tell the person that is helping you just, just to chill at any part of the island. So, go over to the land and just chill. Make sure he does not get kicked. But for you... Make your way over to your apartment building. By now, you should know where it's at. It's already 10 years old, this game, to be honest. Now, go over to the blue marker and blow yourself up inside of the blue marker like this. Doesn't matter if it's an RPG or sticky bomb. And once you do spawn in, go over to the blue marker and it should be putting you into the apartment building like this. Now, basically, what you need to do is save this as an outfit on any outfit slot. It's up to you. It doesn't really matter. And quit the job. Do the job just to your phone. And you should be loading into a random lobby like this. Now, once you do load in, apply your saved outfit and you should see you have the red or black joggers, whatever you saved, and it will stick. Now, let's move on to the other jogger glitch of this video. Now, this method, you can also do this for the female male character as well. Now, for this method, you will need neck and two consoles and any pair of color joggers. It doesn't matter which color joggers it is, the clothing glitch will still work. Now... With their color joggers, you would need to make your way over to any clothing store on the map. And once you're there, you would need to make sure you have a pair of color joggers, right? And you could get every single pair of color joggers through this glitch. Now, make your way over to the nearest clothing store and make sure your color joggers do not have nothing on it. So the only thing you should have on your outfit is the joggers. No shoes, no top, no accessories, no mask, no nothing like that. Now, save that as an outfit on outfit slot 1 and name it C1. Now, these are the components. So, if you want the black joggers, go over to the pants section, go over to the cargo pants, and these are the components to get all the color joggers. So, if you want the blue joggers, 
obviously you go with the gray woodland cargo if you want the red joggers you go to peach digital cargo these are all the components so after you choose your car your cargo color ones that you do want basically save that as an alpha on slot number two and just name it c2 i got once go over to the saved outfits and select the c1 saved outfit now if you do not own a classic parachute you can always buy one at any ammunition store now equip one on through your interaction menu like this Wait for the orange loading screen to show up and disappear on the bottom right. And once it does, basically you will need to go over to your neck cut and lock your primary console and wait about 10 seconds or so. Now, basically what you need to do is go over to console 2. And on console 2, load up GTA 5 story mode and a invite only session if you're on old gen. And if you're on new gen, just load into the main menu and basically load into a public lobby. And if you're on Xbox and if it says something about end session here, just click end session there. Now, basically, once you do load into the public lobby or invite only session, you will need to basically open up your interaction menu, go over to style and select the C2 outfit. Now, wait for the orange loading screen to show up and disappear on the bottom right. Now, once it does, hold down on the D-pad and load into any G25 story mode character. And once you load into story mode, fully close out the G25 application on console 2. If you're on new gen, just quit to the main menu. And once you're on the main menu, just close out the gt5 application now basically what you need to do is go over to console one and make sure do not get kicked then go over to netcut unlock your primary console then go over to the console one and basically remove the classic parachute off your joggers like this do your interaction menu now hold down on the d-pad and wait for the orange loading screen to show up and once it does load into any gt5 story mode character and once you load into story mode basically load into an invite only session and if you're on new gen quit to the main menu then you know load into a public lobby now here's a word for the sponsor hyper resupply do you want to be the richest person in gta 5 online and never grind again well check out hyperresupply.com we are the number one boosting platform we offer services for gta 5 forza horizon 5 need for speed and fifa 23 we also have standard or express delivery time. If you're just looking into buying in-game currency or a modded account, we got you covered. We have the best deals, most legit, and 5-star ratings at hyperresupply.com. If you want to save even more money, go over to the checkout. Use code REBEL to get 10% off your next order. Now, you should basically load in and you should have the color joggers. Now, as long as you save this as an outfit, the color joggers will stick. Now, don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you're new, and also you could do the BEF constantly if you keep on following these steps as well. But yeah, do BEF, you won't delete no outfits as well. But yeah, let's move on to the last jogger glitch of this video. So for this jogger glitch, this only works for the female character. Now this will delete all your outfits, but it wouldn't really matter because basically you will get every single color joggers in the game every single color now you will need to make your way over to any clothing store on the map then you will need to make your way over to the front counter of any clothing store on the map and make sure you save your current outfit on the last outfit slot then back out from the front counter open up your interaction menu go over to online and you will need to go over to swap character and accept that alert that shows up on the screen now you should be loading inside of a small room like this now go over to the second slot character and push edit and if it says something about copying a rank over just copy that rank obviously and on the edit part make sure it's a male character and if it's a male character just go over to save and continue and if it's a female character like mine just basically go over to the sex and put it a male and just go over to save and continue now once you do load into a random lobby just open up your pause menu go over to online and load into an invite only session so the clothing store could pop up for you now, once you do load in, you will need to basically make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Go over to the top section. And once you're at the top section, go over to the tank tops. Now, basically, once you're on the tank tops, purchase the white tank, number 33. Now, the next part is you will need to go over to the shoe section, go over to the skate shoes. And the skate shoes, you will need to purchase the black skate shoes, number two. Now basically go over to the shorts at the pants section and now these are the components to get all the color joggers. So if you want the white 
basically you go over to the 10 stripe boxer shorts and save that as an alpha on slot two now if you want the 10 joggers save that as an alpha on slot number three and you know for the rest you just keep on repeating the steps basically you're only changing the shorts so if you want the pink joggers save the red lip boxer shorts on slot number four you know and just keep on repeating the steps till you get the color joggers you want the most you can save i think is like 16 or 17. now basically go over to the front counter go over to the saved outfits and select every single saved outfit a few times back out from the front counter you will need to open up your interaction menu go over to the easy way out option and easy way out now once you do easy way out you should be spawning outside of the clothing store and once you do spawn outside of the clothing store basically what you need to do is open up your pause menu go over to online go over to the creator should be somewhere in the middle and click creator and accept that alert that shows up on the screen go over to creator rates click tutorial and accept that alert that shows up on the screen now you will need to open up your pause menu go over to online and go over to choose character now that will be putting you into a random gta 5 online lobby afterwards and basically delete the male character on slot number two then hover above the female character on slot number one and return to gta 5 story mode and basically once you do load into story mode obviously uh, you just open up your pause menu go over to online and just load into an invite only session only because you can load into a lobby quicker that way and once you do load in just go over to any clothing store on the map like this go over to the front counter save your current outfit on the last outfit slot then if you go over to the saved outfits just select every single saved outfit a few times and you should see every single color jogger that is there that you saved and basically just edit all the color joggers and all the color joggers will stick and save this as an outfit and catch you on tomorrow's video like video subscribe peace